Happy Saturday. Um, quieting the mind. Getting in touch with yourself through stillness. I, I still struggle with it. I mean, I got to... I got to a place of accepting stillness through extreme just pushing myself, pushing myself. Have to exercise more, have to jump more rope, have to run more, have to push more weights. As a means to quiet, to quiet my, uh, it was a means to tire my body out so much that my mind could let go or that I could let go of holding on so tight. I used to exercise or jump rope to the point of just sheer exhaustion and then could feel like I almost could maybe cry. Um, and then I got into, then I allowed myself to be still enough to start meditating. This was a long time ago for me. And, um, and now when I can sit and be quiet, when I have the patience, I do it once a day at least, but to be able to acknowledge there's this separate thing going on, image factory, I like to think about it, just regardless of what's going on for me, something is always spitting out images. And I, if I can focus enough and I guess in a sense let go enough to just ease into my breath, I can separate from that. And I'm not obsessed with a thought an idea, I don't have to, you know, and there's a lot of ways to do that. There's not, there's a lot of different schools of thought on meditation. If you can just sit and count your breaths, you know, one in, one out, that's a great way to start. That's where I started. Um, people, some people on, you know, meditate on colors and, and, you know, it's whatever, whatever you, whatever you find, you know, there's plenty of applications on, you know, for phones that you can, you can get into, but the freedom to be able to sit with myself and feel this euphoria when I kind of stop thinking in a way. I can see myself thinking, but I'm not attached to the thought. Man, that's... That's awesome. I mean, it's amazing. I, I, I encourage you to try it. Because I think that's where, where life is, in a sense. I mean, this experience, we get to have this experience, but that is a place of what's beyond it. Like this game of, you know, who can get the most money or whatever, all that bullshit that we're taught and we're kind of, it's pushed on us to, uh, to absorb. It's nonsense. I mean, you can want you can want for a lot, but really, the experience between each each of us is seems to be the most relevant of it all. You know, there's there's no there there. It's just right here, and for me, learning to sit still has been a. Uh, an amazing journey, and I and I'm like I said, I'm the always want to do it, but I feel better when it's been done. So um, yeah, I don't know, one step at a time, one day at a time, one breath at a time. Much love. <laughs>